Opposition leader Kamal Pasad Bisasa is calling on government to bring legislation to give effect to the measures put in place on Monday to prevent the spread of COVID-19 virus. At a media briefing at the opposition leader's office, Mrs. Pasad Bisasa said, in principle, the measures outlined by government are good, but she has serious concerns about the implementation of such. We are told that um, you can't gather and you can't have large gatherings. You should not. But yet we see people going on to Cora, liming in big groups and so on. So at the moment, the government's measures are its measure with respect to restricting and regulating human behavior is operating on the basis of suasion, moral suasion, or as I say, cabinet fiat and dictate. So the cabinet says, do not do this, do not do that, do not do the other. But how do we have it enforced? The opposition leader also has reservations about government's plans to tap into the Heritage and Stabilization Fund to cushion the impact of the economic challenges brought about by COVID-19. So we are not saying we will not support. Again, we'll have to see what the government brings. We can have the government come and say they want three billion, five billion, whatever billion study would like to have to spend. We would, they would have to tell us for what purpose. Is it for hazmat suits? Is it for ventilators? Is it, would it be for beds? Would it be for training of uh, medical personnel, healthcare professionals, healthcare workers? Meanwhile, the Attorney General is looking at legislative measures to address non-compliance bars. This from Minister of Health, Terence Dialsing. He made the comment as he responded to a question in the Senate today, Tuesday. He was asked to indicate what measures the government will adopt to ensure compliance with its COVID-19 advisory in light of reports that some bars have remained open and some churches are continuing services. The minister added that the Minister of National Security also met with officials of the TTPS the Chief of Defence Staff to look at other measures.